Assalamu alaikum dear students, I hope you will be fine. In today's topic, I am going to teach you the one of the science special topic which is related to quantity surveying and our topic is how to calculate quantity of mortar in a brick work. So dear students, in today's topic, we are going to study that how we can calculate total quantity of mortar in a brick work and then total quantity of cement and sand on those mortar. So dear students, let's suppose we have a room and the length of the room is 12 feet and the width of the room is also 12 feet and the total height of the room is 11 feet and the wall thickness of this room is 9 inches and dear students in given data it is also mentioned that the total height of the door is 7 feet and the total width of the door is 4 feet so now dear students to calculate total quantity of mortar in this brickwork first of all we calculate total quantity of brickwork in this room so dear students, to calculate total quantity of brickwork, if we calculate total volume of this one wall, if we multiply total length of this wall and total height of this wall and then total thickness of the wall which is 9 inches, so we divide this 9 inches by 12 to convert into feet because the other two units is also in feet. So dear students, we can get the total volume of this one wall. So now dear students, if we calculate total quantity of brickwork of this four wall so if we multiply four because the total number of wall is four with the nine nine cubic feet so we can get the total quantity of brickwork so now dear students just you can see over here from this total volume we subtract the total volume of this door so dear students to calculate total volume of this door if we multiply seven times four to calculate total surface area of this door and then we multiply this surface area with the wall thickness which is 9 inches so we can get the total volume of this door and now dear students if you want to calculate total net volume of brickwork so if we take this 3996 cubic feet and we subtract the total subtract volume of a door so we can get the total net volume of brickwork so now dear students if the total brickwork volume is 375 cubic feet so what should be the total quantity of mortar in this volume so dear students remember that the total quantity of mortar depend on the joint thickness so dear students if we provide the joint thickness of 1 by 4 inches so we take the total quantity of mortar 20 percent of the total brickwork volume and dear students if we provide the joint thickness of 3 by 8 inches so we take the total mortar quantity 30 percent of the total brickwork volume and dear students if we provide our joint thickness 1 by 2 inches so we take total quantity of mortar 40 percent of the total volume of a brickwork so now dear students let's suppose our brickwork is joint thickness of 3 by 8 inches so we take total quantity of mortar 30% of the total brickwork volume. So dear students, if we multiply these two terms, we can get the total quantity of mortar in term of 90 cubic feet. And now dear students, if you want to calculate total quantity of cement and sand in this mortar volume, so dear students, let's suppose the mortar ratio is 1 ratio 4, where 1 represents total quantity of cement and 4 represents total quantity of sand. So dear students, to calculate total quantity of cement and sand in this mortar volume, so first of all we take sum up ratio. So dear students, if we add the total quantity of cement and total quantity of sand, so we can get the sum up ratio. So now dear students, in this total 5 part, this one part represents the total quantity of cement. So what should be the total volume of cement in this volume? So dear students, if we multiply 1 by 5 with this volume, so we can get the total quantity of cement in term of 18 cubic feet. Now dear students, if you want to convert this total volume into a number of kg or in term of bag, so remember if we have one bag of cement, so the weight of one bag of cement is 50 kg and the volume of one bag of cement is 1.25 cubic feet. So dear students, if we divide this term by 1 to 5 cubic feet, so we can get the total number of bags which is used in this mortar. And now dear students, if you want to calculate total quantity of sand, so just you can see over here, if the total part is 5, 
and four fat is sin. So if we take total quantity of sin four by five and then multiply by this volume, so we can get the total quantity of sin which is used in this volume. So dear student, this is our today topic that how we can calculate total quantity of mortar in a brickwork and how we can calculate total quantity of cement and sand on those mortar. So dear students, this is our today topic. I hope you will be learning something new from this lecture. If you have any question related to this topic, please comment on my channel. I will try to reply your answer. So see you in next video. Thanks for watching. Allah Hafiz.